everyone, it's Nona Grace, and I'm from Western New York. Today, I just got warm, just thinking about doing my video. I was fine until I came up here, but now I'm actually warm. But I wanted to tell you, I went to the doctor today. <laughs> Guess what they do when you're old? They give you tests. So, I know, it's like, gee whiz. Oh, you're on Medicare now, I see. Yeah, I am, yeah. So that means we have to give you a test to see if your brain is working. Well, let's, they, they were saying that they're going to have to think something else up when, they, when the next generation comes because they didn't have analog clocks. And so they don't know how to draw a clock, I guess. So I had to draw a clock. Then I had to put the numbers on. And she said, try to make them as even as possible. <laughs> so guess what I do? I wish I had a ruler. They would have been better, but I did the 12 and the 6 and the 3 and the 9, and then I filled in, and it, it looks pretty good. And then I said, but it needs hands. And she, so I started to draw a hand, and she goes, oh, and I want you to make it 11, 10. And I go, oh, you could have chose the direction my hand was already going. <laughs> but no, so I scribbled that hand out and did 11, 10. <sighs> and then they give you three words that you have to remember. I forgot one of the words. Can you believe it? I did, and I and then it bothered me because the word was picture, and I kept thinking, gee whiz, can I do that over? But no, and I said, does it make a difference that I forgot one word? And she goes, no. She says they, they can tell by just talking to you whether you've got a problem or not with maybe you have Alzheimer's or dementia or something. Well, my one in my um, next time when they do it, I'm going to make a story out of my words because those words meant nothing. It was colonel, garden, and picture. And picture. <laughs> it's like, okay, they don't mean nothing to me. So next time I'm going to say the colonel planted a garden So and then he took a picture and make it a story and make it, did you ever hear the story about the colonel, the garden, and the picture? Well now you, now yeah. you will remember those words because that's the words that they gave me and and then they then she says now we're going to take your blood pressure i go oh sure after you give me a test that made my blood pressure because i don't do well with tests tests make me very nervous so they take my blood pressure and guess what my blood pressure was it was 140 over 60 something and i go ooh, that's high of course it's high you just gave me a test and <laughs> it's like you just oh, stressed, stressed me, out. me out big time. So she said, well, before you go, we'll take it one more time. And so they did, and it was a nice, it was 121 over 67 or something like that. And then I just took it, and it's 111 over 67 or 76. I don't remember which numbers, I you know, probably reverse numbers. But it was like, because um, my, my blood pressure is usually rather low, but boy, going to the doctor can be stressful. Then you walk into the the. You get to the door and you have to read all this stuff, the rules of the place before you can enter. And then I see the lady going, come on, come in, come in. Well, I guess the lobby was empty and they have a desk sitting there. Instead of going up to the desk where we used to go, there's a desk sitting there and she asks a bunch of questions. And then she takes your temperature and then you get to go sit down and they've got some of the chairs backwards and some of the chairs the right way and so I sat in a chair where I usually sit right around the same spot and then um, the nurse comes out and she calls my name and I go and I get weighed and I found out that I had a, they weighed me and I was like I, I, my when I weighed myself at home I was 111 something when I weighed myself there I was 110 something and then they must have taken off two pounds for my clothes, which I don't think my clothes weighed that much. So I ended up with a 108, which is a good weight. It's more than I weighed last year when I went. I was 105, I think, when I went last year. You're probably thinking, oh my goodness, you're tiny. <laughs> yeah, no, I'm bigger than what I should be for my size. You're but tiny. I'm yep. tiny. But when I was single, I was really tiny, mm -hmm. really tiny. I was so small. <laughs> I liked it better, but I didn't realize I was so small until now that I'm bigger. And um, so then they measured me, and because I had on the shield, I had to take it off to move it down. So that, and she didn't wait till I stood straight up, and she took my 
measurement and so I lost a quarter of an inch but last year I gained the quarter of inch that I lost the year before so you tell me there so they when they measure you I don't think they're measuring true and I went with my own hair not this hair so that I looked like an old lady <laughs> you never look like an old lady I thought I did and so the the um then they took my blood I, I fasted over the night. I My last meal was at 6 o'clock or 8 o'clock is when I had a cup of coffee. So 8 o'clock really. And I fasted all through the night and my appointment was 10 after 9. And then they took the blood work probably more like 10 o'clock. And then I came home and I worked on my, I made the coffee. I had fed the chickens and the dog before I left. But I, I made my coffee and then I sat down at the computer. But I was the coffee was brewing while I was working on the computer. And um, I thought, gee, maybe I should go have a cup of that coffee. And when I got up, it was almost noon. So I finally had my first cup of coffee today at noon. Then I was working away, working away, working away. And I finally got done at quarter after four, I think it was, or some near 4.30. And I went into the my craft room, well, my sitting room. It's, yeah. Now it's my craft room. Because <laughs> I do my crafts in there. I went in there and I was watching Pamela's Adoring Crochet because she was making a new shawl. It was a different stitch than what she did before. And so I thought, well, I will work on this. So I started it. And the, the skein of yarn, I'm telling you, these people that are putting these skeins together, either that or I'm just getting the bad skeins that everybody left behind because there wasn't much to choose from. I showed Jim there was three places that you could have pulled uh, because there was three cuts. And I'm thinking, what are these cuts for? I haven't come across. I actually pulled one. Luckily, I pulled the right one. There's, you know, when you there's, think. I think I did because it's, it's coming out all right. It's, it's, it showed up. It did knot up a little bit and then I pulled some more and I got a big clump out. And I untangled that knot, and it's coming okay. But I haven't gotten to these other ones where I don't know why they cut it. But they've got a lot of cuts in it. So we'll have to make some knots in it. And I thought I would do that. Then I thought, well, I better go out and do my walking because today is the day I'm supposed to put all my numbers in. So when I put this video up, you'll see my numbers. I'll put them at the end. I want to try to make them scroll like Pam did. But I don't know. We'll see. <laughs> I'm not real technical like these. Some of these videos that I'm watching, they have like productions in the front. It's really amazing some of the work that's being done. It looks like I'm going to watch a movie just about. Mine is just kind of my little music and it's quick and fast. I'm going to keep that because I like it. But I do want to have the numbers scroll if I can. If not, they'll just be written there and you'll just see that and I'll hold it there. For, I'll just stretch the line to make sure they stay long enough so you can read them. And so I took some uh, walk a little bit after I watched a little bit of Pamela's, Pamela's. and I went outside and I thought I better walk. Jim went mowing and so I thought well I'll walk a little bit. And I had another thought, and I just lost it. See? <laughs> oh, good grief. I was going to go somewhere with it, and I forgot where I was going. Oh, man. Oh, man. So have you been doing that ever since I, I know you? <laughs> ever I since they gave me that memory test. <laughs> I, I walked through a doorway. I was, it was like crazy. I walked through the doorway, turned the television down, because I was going to tell Jim something, and I thought, I forgot what I was going to tell you. So I walked back through the two doorways that I walked through because you know when you walk through a doorway your mind gets wiped three wiped clean. And as soon as I got to the second doorway and opened it and walked halfway through I remembered. So I came back out and I said you know there was somebody that that um, had mentioned that when they were hatching an egg I can't remember who it was now. You'll know you'll recognize your comment. Um, but they had they had put the egg in a little basket with some straw and put a light shining on it and they hatched and so I'm hoping that this little egg will hatch who knows mm -hmm. I don't know and I had another request this isn't what I was gonna say but I remember it now so I better do it really? I had another request that when I have this the hair on they'd like to see the back so I will turn around and show you the back uh, Jim will have to see whether I'm in the camera or not because I don't know if I'm in the camera so flip the 
flip the thing, and I will turn. Yeah, turn. now you are. Okay. Because I raised what, it up. Oh, and what I if like. If it wiggles, it's my fault. Okay. And I like that I can just do this. And they say, if you have a wig on, never have this down straight. Use your fingers and fluff it. So that's what I do. And so that's what I do. I fluff it. I like that you can fluff it. And then it looks, oops, uh, hello. Mm -hmm. I want to see me back again. Just a minute. Okay, he's putting me down. Mr. Brown, put me down. Oops, I was upside down for a minute. And I got to see if the front's okay. Because I messed with it. Okay, and am I lined up? I'm lined up. Okay. Very good. Well, that's the back. So I showed the back. And I think it was Gloria that wanted to see the back. I I hope I got the names right of who wanted to see what. I was going to look it up, and then I forgot to look it up. So, I don't know. Oh, are I you getting old? <laughs> no. <laughs> You're so mean. I'm don't you mean. dare be mean. I'm They'll mean. pick if he's picking on me. You pick on him. <laughs> yep. And it'll be in my comments, I'm sure. Yep. Okay. I guess I can't remember what I was going to say. I was going to say something. I was on a roll, a real roll. But I had a lot of things that were click, 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 click through my brain, and it's like I want to touch on all of them. So if you come back tomorrow, I might remember. <laughs> so I'll see you then. <laughs> Bye.